So if you've seen my older videos on the Graph CMS, you've learned that it's pretty easy to download and set up. In this video, I'm going to show you how to use the terminal to install the Graph CMS as well as start a server. And we're going to be using Composer. Here's a third option, which is installing from Git. You're simply cloning the repo and then running Composer install so you can get all the dependencies. And then again, depending on how you have your web server up, whether it's something like MAP or XAMPP or your uh, built-in PHP environment, uh, you just start it from the web root. I have Composer installed globally on this machine. If you don't, you'll need to create a folder and install um, Composer there. And then once you do that, you can run this uh, command here. I'm just going to click on this icon at the upper right and copy this to my clipboard. And then back in my terminal, I'll paste that in there. And I'm going to delete this last part and call my folder grav-cms. Then I'll hit return. And in doing that, we'll begin the installation of all the uh, dependencies. Once Composer is finished installing dependencies, you can change directory into the folder. So I'm going to type cd uh, space grav dash cms. And then back on the installation page, if you scroll a bit to the bottom, you'll see the web server command right here. I'm going to click on the clipboard to copy. And by the way, this is at learn.getgrav.org. And then when I return to my terminal, I'm just going to paste that in. If you're on a PC, you can just right click and I'll paste that. When I hit return, it's going to tell me where my server is running on. You can see here it's a local host 8000. So I'll just copy that. And why don't I just paste it over here? No, how about this one. And there you have it. You'll see Grav is running without the admin. If I were to type admin at the end, you get a 404 error. So the admin plugin is something that uh, you have to install separately. If you go to the admin documentation page, in the introduction section, you'll see here, if you scroll down a bit, a command bin slash gpm. That is the built-in package manager for Grav. And if you copy it and run the command in terminal, you'll see that three dependencies will be included. We have form, email, and login. Type yes, or y for yes, and then hit return. And when the installation is finished, you can simply hit the up key until you get back to your server command and hit return. And now let's try running this again. And you'll see that we've had our admin registration page. Before you can get to the admin dashboard, you'll need to create a user. I won't go through these steps. Um, this video was really just about showing you how to install Grav from the terminal, how to run the server from the web root, and how to install the admin plugin. Thanks for watching.